Oh good. Yeah. Happy from the Z It's fun. Oh. It is, yeah. <laughs> um, so we're going to be driving up to these that, that plantation up there. Yep. Up on the skyline, and then we're going to go down and up. And if you look right through the back, yep. we're going back up into that snowy stuff. So that's where we're going to. Yeah. That's what we now we can see it. Just make sure you're all still happy with that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. All good. It's going to be cold, but we'll give it a crack. Lots of geese. Close as I can get right now. It is nasty. I feel like the Michelin man. Well, we just pulled in and got unloaded. This by far, hands down, will be the toughest one we do here in New Zealand looking for a wild chucker. We're up high, it's snow, windy, nasty, storm coming in. And then just not very many chuckers here in New Zealand either, but we think we know where there's a covey. Uh, one of the local guys that hunts here for red, red deer and red stag. Saw a couple when they were here hunting last time, so we're gonna go in that general area and just start walking. We got his lab and we'll just cover as much ground as we can this afternoon. The wind and snow is coming though. It is uh, by far the coldest we've been here. It's, there's no way around it, it's going to be miserable. Which face are we heading to? Oh, right, sorry. So, so that track, see the track far over there? Yep. That not, not far, far away, but just this first ridge line. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's yeah. a few gates to open, unfortunately. Again, there's a lot of gates by the time we get all the way. Yeah, yeah we're, there's <laughs> gates all over New Zealand. That's what the country was built on. <laughs> Got into a real big one, like up from the lodge, right up. Just you know, the track you can go down the ridge, right down to the gut. Yeah. Um, one farm that way in the Kakanui Gorge is a few. There's a few good ones there, but lots of different sites. They'll always be at about the same contour. Oh, really? Like 3,000, 3,200 feet. Okay. So, so high. Yeah. You'll be quite often. You could be tar hunting, and and you'll hear them, like yeah. their calls or something. I drove in here for the first time in the dark. Thought I was gonna die. <laughs> ready to roll here. The wind is howling up here. We're going to cruise along this side hill. This is where they've been seeing them the last couple times. Now, the last couple times there wasn't snow and the weather wasn't like this, so I don't exactly know what that's going to do to the birds, but we're going to go into the wind on the first pass and then just kind of keep cruising this hillside. If they go in front of us, if we're staggered, because if, if anyone flushes anything, yep. it's going to come down over top and then you're in behind so you can Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So if we just and we basically just beat across, we'll just go across the face, all just spread apart. Okay. And I think once we get out of this little bit here, the wind will drop off a wee bit. Okay. And anything I've seen's been flushing downhill, so. But luck Sounds good. The top here, and we'll be all happy days. Sounds good. Hey, dog. Where is he? Where is he? Seek him, seek him. Got 
got tracks that, here. Here's tracks here, definitely here. Got tracks here. Yeah, I've got good fresh ones here too. Got chunker See tracks here. right here. Yeah, good ones. Definitely chuck it. Go back and work where the tracks are because the birds must be there. Yeah. Because I love it. It's run out once we lost that wee outcrop. There was quite a lot of sign and it now it's, it's stopped. It's like that. It's not like they've shifted along the face here and it's yeah. going to be more exposed. So we might just have to maybe work up and down the contour where the, where the sign is. That works. Yeah. So there's been a wee few. Well, there's been a few of them following each other up. See, they're there. There's two tracks right here. Yeah, and the ice there. Yeah. Oh, maybe we just keep pushing on. Just keep following. Yeah, they're here though. And they've been here today. Yeah. I think if we just stay on the track, yeah. we'll go, or Mark can stay on the track, yeah. and then I'll, I'll come up, I'll go up here, yeah. maybe 20 to 50 yards. Yeah. And just because you, you know his tracks back this way? No. no. No, so they're obviously pushing around here. Oh, I yeah. think the wind will stop them. They won't go too far that way. They might just be sitting in this heavy cover. Yeah. But see, the dog's not real interested either. Uh -uh. Like it's not. They haven't been here in the last couple hours. No, yeah. no. The dog, if it was a hot scent, the dog would be gone. It'll be off. Took off right in front of me in a nick. Yeah. Right underneath the track. They were right underneath the track, right up there. Oh. They yeah. must have been up Unless there. Unless they were just up and popped down. Yeah. Boy, they've sat tight. Right, we've walked right around them. Oh. All right, get their walking shoes on. Yeah. Well, let's go after them. I'm pissed. Yeah, I reckon if we go, we'll just go straight down this gut, and we'll go in below. We might spread out, go below that wee outcrop, uh -huh. and just come back around there in a bend. Yep. And if we just, is everyone happy to go down there? Yeah. yeah, we'll just walk in a line and see if we can put them up again. Yeah. They're here anyway, Mark. Yeah. They've probably never been shot at before. These ones won't have been? No. no. Here, does he come? Does he come? Plenty of day left, Mark. What's that? There's plenty of day left. Oh, yeah. In New Zealand, if you can see, you can hunt. So you just stay going. <laughs> Hunt back from this way because they got they, they would they went back and down one didn't they? Yeah. They dropped back that way and that and all the tracks are back there. You want to hunt this one up and then catch that one? Yeah. Maybe we go we hunt up here. Yep. Up over that we saddle and then come back around and then we'll we'll put you down below us again and then we'll go just carry on back that way. Yep. Hunt back that way. That they'll be that way not this way. They won't yep. have gone into the wind. And, the, and like up higher, there was no tracks up higher, everything's, and there's tracks back that way, so they'll go back where they've been. Yep. Oh, here we go, birds! Just watch them. Look at them. I can't see them. Were there just two? Three. Three. Maybe I'll just send the dog through where they're at because I, I could have hit one of them. If there's only three, there were more. But there's, I, I just, we should just keep pushing here. I think come in. Here we go, bird. Yeah! yeah! Oh, Woohoo! Woo! Yes! yes! Look! Yeah, man! Yeah! Woo! Woo! in your wheel, baby! Woo! The dog's gone. Look at the dog. Oh. Ah. Oh. <laughs> nice job. Oh, oh. oh that's awesome. The there might be more here, man. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, fantastic. That's awesome. What a shot too. Wow. That is awesome. How far do you think that shot was? 
<laughs> I can't believe how far that shot was. That bird, I won't lie, he was out there 80 so yards. I let him 15, 20 yards, and it may have been one BB, but one BB is better than none. And he just went down right there, and that's a chucker in New Zealand right there. That is awesome. That was going to be the hardest bird of the slam. We got a pheasant left for upland, and that's it. That one right there is by far the hardest. I can't wait to get my hands on him. That man. Oh my goodness. It's the hardest game bird to get in New Zealand. That is awesome. That is fantastic. Thank you. Thank you so much. That is awesome. Oh my goodness. He's got a. He's hit well, hit anyway. Oh yeah, good. That's well, right. better hit well than not. Absolutely. That's fantastic. Open country hunting. Beautiful shot. Lucky shot. Yeah. Lucky we've got, shot. We've got maybe half an hour of light left. Hardest bird to get. That's fantastic. High country, South Island, New Zealand. Wild chucker. Doesn't get much better than that. got into the pheasant spot that we're going to give a try here. We're in uh, South Central South Island and it's kind of this brushy bottom area that's been known to hold a lot of birds. We've got a dog with us today and we're going to kind of push this this creek bottom. There's some trees and thickets and so forth and hopefully we can get a couple roosters up and get on them today. It's gorgeous chilly morning here. Temp's finally starting to drop. Feels like a good day to go chase pheasants. some birds working in the middle here. Dogs are almost to them. rooster right there that's a the gorgeous one couldn't get any more picturesque right over the creek and of course right in the water nothing like a wet pheasant but it's awesome
we're just bouncing to one more spot here before we call it. It's another thick tree line. Looks like there are going to be a bunch of birds tucked in here from what we've seen so far. What an awesome way to end it here in New Zealand. A couple more roosters just at the end. Man, another awesome slam down waterfall, turkeys, pukekos, you name it. This place has kind of got it all. And this has been the most diverse slam that I've done to date. Couldn't think of a better way to end it than though with the rooster pheasant.